Hello viewers, so in this video I am going to show you some interesting chemical reactions with an interesting chemical potassium permanganate. These are the crystals of potassium permanganate. This is the water solution of potassium permanganate. A small amount of potassium permanganate gives an intense purple color to water. Now, potassium permanganate is known for its highly oxidizing nature. So, it's a strong oxidizing agent. It can oxidize almost anything. It can oxidize almost all the chemicals, all the organic compounds, all the cells of your body, all the microbes, all the germs it can kill. So, that is why it is also used as an antiseptic or a disinfectant. So, in this video, I'm going to show you the oxidizing reactions potassium permanganate on four different chemicals first one is ethanol second is glucose solution third is hydrogen peroxide and fourth is hydrochloric acid so here i have some ethanol in this test tube and i'll add some potassium permanganate to it Here you can see the reaction seems quite mild. No reaction seems to occur here. But let's wait for some time. Now here after almost 5 minutes you can see the color of this ethanol solution is not at all or purple but a little reddish orange color. The powerful oxidizing agent potassium permanganate has oxidized ethanol and has led to the formation of ethanoic acid or acetic acid which is present in vinegar. Now here I have some glucose solution in this test tube. Again the reaction is quite mild. No apparent reaction seems to occur but let's wait again. So almost after 5 minutes you can see the color of this glucose solution. It was purple earlier and now it is of amber color. So this shows that the, the potassium permanganate solution has oxidized the glucose solution. After a while you will also notice that this orange color will also disappear and a colorless solution will be formed. Now in this third reaction, I have some hydrogen peroxide solution in this. Now just see, as I add this solution to it, it decolorizes and the pink color goes away. Now if you carefully notice, I'll add once again. There are bubbles in this test tube. solution is turning yellow now a vigorous reaction has taken place in this oxygen gas is released in this reaction you can see the yellow color is actually due to potassium permanganate has been reduced to manganese dioxide now these bubbles you can see these bubbles are of oxygen gas which is being released in this reaction so here the Potassium permanganate acts as an oxidizing agent whereas the hydrogen peroxide acts as a reducing agent. The chemical equation is written below. Now for the fourth reaction I have hydrochloric acid in this test tube, a strong acid. Now just observe the test tube. You can see that the color of the potassium permanganate has disappeared. Once more, I'm adding again, it has disappeared. Now, this yellow color is probably due to chlorine gas that is being produced in this reaction. See, slowly it has turned colorless because chlorine gas has been released. You can see some vapors being condensed on the inner walls of the test tube. So this chlorine gas here is being released because the strong oxidizing agent potassium permanganate has oxidized the chloride ion in hydrochloric acid to chlorine gas. So here the oxidizing nature of potassium permanganate comes into play in this reaction. 
so in this video we saw the oxidizing nature of potassium permanganate on four different chemicals so once again if you see here this was the glucose solution this is the ethanol solution which is turned to an amber color so thank you for watching this video and do not forget to like subscribe and share